Hey everybody, it's Faith from Fire Sign Tarot. Hope everybody's well. Um, I know I'm way behind for the month of February. I didn't. I've. I haven't even finished February reads at this point. I didn't get to the cusp babies this month. I didn't get to round two this month. I apologize. It's been a month. And if any of you checked out my community post or saw it, for those of you who didn't, brief announcement before I start this: the old man. Our, our beloved tabby cat, Tigger Poo, passed away this week, and so I've been dealing with that, both on a physical, the, the last of the to-dos, when, when you lose a fur baby, and the, um, the emotional and the energetic having to deal with it, I just, what little vibe I had, done, <laughs> gone. Um, yesterday, yes, I did have yesterday off for the bread and butter job, but I was dealing with that because we had to um, say our final buys and deal with the crematory and paying the bill. And but neither here nor there. Um, he is going on to a better place. He is, and I, I, I firmly and fully believe that the fur babies and the feather babies and the scale babies and whatever kind of pets that you might have, I believe they're all our soulmates as well. And I, I fully believe that if I don't see him again in this life, I will definitely see him in the next because me and that cat, we were tight. Let me tell you, we were tight and losing him was, was very difficult, but fixing the vibe. All right. Weekly read, February 26th through March 4th, 5th? I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to do it to the 5th. I'm going to do it to the 5th of March. All right. Oh, I go by the elements. It just makes for a faster read because I've been sitting here babbling enough. Um, any dates where your sun sign falls, it'll all be in the description box of this channel, along with the beginning spiel that I would normally do. I just have it all typed out in the description now. All right, we're just going to hop right into it. We're going to start with our water signs. Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, February 26th to the 5th of March. I'm going to go ahead and tip down, and we're going to get this party started. Here we go. Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus. Ten of Swords, the end of a painful cycle. On a side note, Tigger Poo was a Scorpio. So, okay. All right. Three good shuffles. One, two. Okay. That was weird, but do what you're going to do. One more. See if we can actually get it to do it. I almost did it. I caught myself. <laughs> I caught myself. You're letting something go and moving on. That's what you're doing. Four of Pentacles reversed. Eight of Cups. The challenge is the moving on, moving forward. You're you're and you're closing out a painful cycle here. You're releasing. Four of Pentacles reversed. You're letting go. Five of Swords reversed, Judgment reversed, and the Moon. Hmm. Huh. All right. Why?
Okay. It didn't kick off. Possibly there was too many people involved. Ten of Cups. That's an out of place Ten of Cups. But again, tens are endings, guys. Tens are endings. Empress reversed. Ace of Wands reversed. This was not meant to grow or go anywhere. Yes, it's painful. Yes, it sucks. Bottom of the deck. The Fool, yes. Time to start off with something new. Alright, let's get a little clarity. From a water sign, friends. A little clarity. Get you. Get back in there. I dropped it. We're not even going to address it. Okay. You all address. It's fine. The chariot. It's forward movement. That's distance. Could be a cancer. That's placing distance. I'm hearing it's time to distance yourself. It flew out. It said it wanted to talk, so I let it talk. Just go with it. Just go with it. What would I going to address first? I want to talk about this Five of Swords reverse. That's... Knight of Pentacles reversed. Queen of Cups. Six of Swords reversed. <laughs> Return. Seven of Cups at the bottom of the deck. Some of them may be returning because they still want to be seen as an option. They still ain't got nothing to offer you. Just throwing that out there. Why the Queen of Cups? This feels like somebody trying to come back with a tail between their legs. Five of swords reversed. Six of swords reversed. Queen of cups, full reversed. You don't trust me farther. You can throw them. You're not going to. If you're gonna, not going to start something new here, you don't trust them. You love yourself more. I feel like you're going to come to the conclusion that you love yourself more and there ain't a damn thing wrong with that. Why is judgment reversed here? Why judgment reversed? Why judgment reversed? Why judgment reversed? <laughs> I feel like you're de going to declare a relationship dead and work on you. Or you're going to start working more, picking up more hours at your job, concentrating on work, concentrating on other things, putting effort into other things, but not whatever is trying to come back to haunt you. Lovers. Oh, why the lovers? I got Cancer on the board. I got Gemini on the board. I got Pisces. I got Aries, Taurus, Gemini. Queen of Swords. She's a decision maker. Mm -hmm. She's a decision maker. And when her mind's made up, her mind's made up. And when her mind's made up, people get cut out of people's lives. People get gone. Yeah, decision to make. Mm -hmm. It might be a hard one. Lovers also indicates a soulmate connection. Definite connection runs deep, but it also indicates a choice. Why is the moon here? Why the moon? 
Some okay, because we're so late in the month of February. Oh wait, duh. I'm not doing a monthly, I'm doing a weekly. Wow. Grief brain, y'all just go with it. Some okay. Get back to what I was saying. Some of these events may have already played out, so time's fluid, y'all. Time's fluid. Five of Swords upright, Nine of Pentacles. Yes, yes, yes. Too many unknowns. You're choosing you. You're choosing you. Tower reversed at the bottom of the deck, or it was, till I hit it. King of Pentacles decided to come out at the bottom of the deck. Three of Pentacles, Eight of Wands reversed. There could be some cooperation, friend zoning, but it's going to be after some distance has been put in there. Too many unknowns. Okay. Why the Ace of Pentacles? Why the Ace of Pentacles reversed? I'm talking about why it all happened now. Some women to grow. the seed that didn't sprout. Five of Cups reversed. Either you or the person you're dealing with may have had some unresolved emotions with something completely outside of this. Three of Cups. Could have been a third party involved. I'm not, I'm not addressing that anymore. Mm. Why the Three of Cups? Nine of Swords. Yeah. Yeah. Two of Cups. It's somebody else on the mind. Somebody had somebody else on the mind. Started something new before something ended. Third party involvement. Even if that third party is not physically involved, somebody's headspace was somewhere else. Why the Ten of Cups? Five Wands reversed. They returned to somebody else. Either you did or they did. Somebody did. A conflict ended. They returned to complete a cycle. Or you. Somebody did. I don't know who did what. Place yourself wherever you see fit. I'm just reading energies here, guys. I just read energies. All right. Why the Empress reversed for a conclusion to this? The Star. The Ten of Cups. The Ten of Wands. I feel like you're going to accept that this wasn't meant to go anywhere. I feel like you're going to heal. I feel like you're going to find your own ten cups and you're going to release your own ten wands. Letting some go, y'all. Allowing a painful cycle to come to an end. Getting tens. You got tens. Tens are endings. Something's coming to a conclusion, but you have to put that distance in there. If they do try to come back, you ain't doing nothing with it. And as long as you stay in the stance, I ain't touching this with a 10-foot pole. If that's a 10-foot pole you're not touching it with. <laughs> Why the Ace of Wands reversed? Why the Ace of Wands reversed? Why the Ace of Wands reversed? Oh, it gave me a fat wad. Yep. Death reversed, King of Wands reversed, Page of Pentacles reversed, Seven of Cups reversed, Four of Cups. It's going to go right back to where it was. Round the round, round the wheel you go. It's going to be the never ending story. If you try to touch this with a 10 foot pole, you're going to be right back where you were again. 
confused. Do I want the cup or don't I? Why are they not taking my cup? Somebody's looking down at three cups. And not looking at yours. You're not looking at theirs. Put yourself wherever you see fit, y'all. Offers being rejected. Things not moving forward because something didn't end that needed to. Bottom of the deck. King of Cups reversed. That's an emotional train wreck. Give me a wisdom. Imagine. This is where you create your own reality, by the way. Number 20, it's a 10. Turning imagination into manifestation, creative thought, visualization, the power of aligning imaginary and feelings, creativity, and illusions. The Oracle message. Who do you want to be? What do you need to believe in? Sorry, what do you need to believe in order to have the life that you want? You were gifted with the power to imagine. If you can dream it, you can create it. This is the time when your imagination is the key to manifesting the life you desire. Spend time daydreaming and fashioning a vision board to help you see your goals or meditating. Allow the power of your creativity to deliver images of what feeds your soul. Then allow your feelings to mingle with your inspirations and imagine these things being real right now. Then repeat. What you imagine will become your belief. And soon you will see things come to pass in the outer world as if by magic. If you want to manifest the same story over and over again, go for it. And you don't have to do that with the same person. If you keep reliving the same nightmare with different characters... It's because you got sucked into that belief system. If you want more for your life, you have to believe it and you have to know it. That's not I wish I want. That's I believe and I know. Water sign babies. This has been your weekly read. I'm going to pause, clear the decks. We're going to move on to fire. Fire. Oh my gosh, I was having a little bit of a sneezing fit, so I had to, like, delay a little bit longer for that. All right, fire. Aries, Leo, Sagittarius, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus. Gave me two. I'm going to take them. February 26th through March 5th. The Hierophant and the King of Cups. Oh, snap. Fire. What's up with this? Could be a Taurus. Could be another water sign. You could have Taurus or water somewhere in your chart. Huh. Don't speak. Just shuffle and throw them down. more. Now, now, come on. Six of pentacles upright, five of pentacles reversed.
bottom of the deck is the hermit. Somebody's on the path. That lonely trail. Self-reflection. That's deep. Wow. Don't let this wreck you. Don't let it wreck you. I feel compelled to say to someone out there who might watch this, you made the right choice. Don't second guess yourself. You made the right choice. Give me a flyer. Flyer from a fire. Flyer from a fire. That is not a lazy river, is it? Hmm. Hmm. King of Pentacles up right at the bottom of the deck. Could be an air sign, could be an earth sign. We're gonna shuffle. I got Virgo, I got Leo, I got Gemini, I got Taurus, for those of you who are keeping track of that. Could be anybody. You're regaining your balance. But the challenge is coming out of the cold with someone or someone trying to come out of the cold with you. Possibly could have been a committed relationship. See, we've got to double down here. we got a Hierophant and a King of Cups. Could have been a committed relationship. I'm not sure if this is what you're moving toward or you're moving away from. But I feel like somebody had emotion, didn't show it. The great poker face. I just keep hearing it's resonating in my head. You made the right decision. All right. What's up with this Six of Pentacles? Was squabbling. Seven of Wands, Seven of Wands. Internal battle. Internal battle. Internal struggle. Hermit, Seven of Wands. You finally getting your bearings back? afraid of that. <sighs> Tied and bound. Might have been a toxic situation. Definitely something extremely binding. Can I get something 
on that five of pentacles reversed please somebody's trying to come out of the cold with you You've done run out of patience. You've done run out of patience. Why the sun? The chariot reversed. There's a connection. Could be a family situation. Somebody trying to close a gap. Possibly somebody trying to play the child card. I'm feeling the child card. Maybe that's why you're tied and bound. Could have been a committed relationship. Judgment reversed. Judgment reversed. Judgment reversed. This has been buried for a minute. Somebody called. I'm hearing called game. Somebody called game. Something that got called game. Like cars down on the side of the road. This is not going anywhere. We we're both exiting the vehicle and going opposite directions. King of Swords. King of Swords. stick holding the stick you're going to try to approach this from a logical perspective rather than an emotional one I feel like you don't want nothing to do with whatever they have to offer you you're done lost patience with it why the seven of cups why the seven of cups why the Seven of Cups? Oh, good. Good, not good. Depends on where you're sitting from whoever's perspective we're looking at this from. There's options. There is options. And I feel like somebody isn't going to be too happy with whatever option somebody else picks and the tower is going to come down. I feel like somebody is like sitting watching their phone waiting for another shoe to drop. Just waiting for the shoe to drop. Okay. Why the King of Pentacles reversed? Hi. Knight of Swords. The Lovers. The Five of Pentacles. The decision's going to be made. The conversation's going to happen. <clears throat> a choice is going to be made someone may be left feeling a little less than don't know if it's you or whoever you're dealing with but it's a vibe I'm getting off that lovers reversed five of swords reversed I feel like it might be you Place yourself wherever you see fit. Why the four swords reversed? For why this all happened? Why the four swords reversed? Restless energy. Queen of Pentacles.
Five of Swords. Somebody may have been restless. So I got bored. There's a very meh energy coming off of that. Meh. What page want? Anybody gets bored easy, it's that little page wands because he's always got to be doing something. He's always got to be starting something new. Eight of Pentacles. Justice reversed. Yeah. Somebody got restless, somebody got bored. Why the Eight of Pentacles? Page of Wands reversed. Hmm. All working to a play. Why justice reversed? Thank you. Judgment reversed. The fool, the king of cups, the moon reversed. Someone wasn't moving forward. Oh gosh, wow. Something got left hanging out there. I feel like somebody left a situation simply because they were bored. Or they weren't getting en enough attention. Or felt they weren't getting enough attention and they went off and found attention elsewhere. Threw things off balance. Went off, started something new. Truths were told. I think something was left incomplete. Still tied and bound. But somebody's about to make up their mind. Somebody needs to stick to their guns. If you got bored on me once, you're going to get bored on me again. Why the lovers are reversed? Ten of Cups reversed. This decision will not bring me happiness. I want the decision that's going to bring me happiness. Ace of Swords, Temperance, Eight of Cups, World Reversed. Why the World Reversed? Knight of Wands Reversed. no forward movement. Stagnation. You're moving on to calm, calmer waters. You're moving on to something with potential. 
you're making the decision that's best for you. You want forward movement. Five of Swords reversed. Why the Five of Swords reversed? Five of Wands reversed. You don't want all the conflict and the BS. And we want to avoid the conflict. There's a lack of balance. <laughs> Ten of Swords. I'm leaving it. Ten of Swords. I'm leaving it. You want to put something to an end. That if you go back to it or you allow it to come back to you, it is not going to end. What is this? Like just merry-go-round stories tonight? What is this? Well, you're on a journey. You're on a path. This is a matter of self-reflection indeed. What do I want for my life? What is going to make me happy? What is going to help my journey? Higher power number four. Like it. You know, when, when, when you go hermit and you walk that path of inner reflection, that's some serious time with Source because Source is your light. Source is the light within you that you find to light your path. Sometimes the light of Source has to come from within you. You have all the answers, you just have to find them. Conscious contact with a higher power. The presence of the divine, seeing source energy in all things, committing to a partnership with spirit. Well, I'll be darned. This card reminds you that you are more than a person trying to get ahead and make things happen for yourself and others. You have an immortal soul and are gifted with a human life through which a higher power can express itself. At this time, you need to be conscious of your connection to spirit and foster it through prayer and meditation. Ask, what is the highest good for all? How can I serve? Then, get out of your own way and trust that there is a plan for your life more wondrous than you can ever know. You are always protected and divinely directed. I'm going to shut up now, fire signs. It just reiterates what I said when I started throwing cards down. That, that's all it does. I'm going to pause. Clear. We're going to move on to Earth. Okay, Earth signs. Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn, Sun, Moon, Venus, February 26th through the 5th of March. Alright. See who flies out at me. Hi! Nine of Swords reversed. Is that intensified? Or canceled out. I don't know. Let's see what the rest of the cards have to say. Three shuffles. One. Two. Three. be Leo, could be another earth sign. You could have Leo or Earth somewhere other than your sun sign in your chart. Could also be air. This is the happiest card in the deck. I don't think you care. 
I think you got your mojo back. I think you could give two squats less. That's a great place to be in, Earth Science. Talk to me. I do not like that High Priestess reversed. I don't know. Could just be secrets revealed, conversations happening, truths coming out. You're in a good place. You're in a good place. Why? Four of Wands reversed. Knight of Pentacles reversed. Ten of Cups reversed. Page of Cups at the bottom of the deck. Could be something new coming in. You could make... You could want to extend a message to someone. Ten of Pentacles, Nine of Wands. The rise up again. Not only are you in a good place, you're going places. Okay. Got something new coming in. I see doors being closed. I see offers being rejected. I see someone not being too thrilled. But I don't think this person's you. Whatever this is. Wheel of Fortune. That's not the karmic wheel. <laughs> nope. That's the wheel of destiny. That's the protection wheel. Mm-hmm. That's the protection wheel. Whatever's going down right now, it's for your highest good. You have something better coming in. And I feel like you're about to find out. Not even going to address this. I like it. Why the moon reversed? Why the moon reversed? Things being revealed. Patiently waiting for something to fruit. It's reversed. Hangman reversed. <laughs> Somebody's still a little hung up. I don't think it's you. Two of swords. But a decision is about to be made with all the clarity that one can muster. Someone is going to guard themselves. Why the ace of swords? reversed. Mm. The nine of swords upright and the chariot. Why the chariot? God, that feels like conversation time. Six of Pentacles, Page of Pentacles reversed. Conversation's going to happen. I don't feel like it's going to go well. Someone's very anxious. Someone's anxious to approach you, possibly. Possibly there's distance there. They could live a ways away. But this is someone who wants to offer truth. Somebody who wants to level up. Why the page of pentacles reversed? Why the page of pentacles reversed?
holding back an offer. Holding back, they're gonna hold back. They're gonna hold back. They're nervous, they're scared. Why the High Priestess reversed? Why the High Priestess? Swords reversed. I knew there was a reason I didn't like her. Oh gosh. Ooh, Ooh one more. Attitude. <laughs> and it's time for a little self reflection. Ten of swords at the bottom of the deck. Somebody. Somebody feels betrayed. Somebody feels hurt. I feel like someone has done nothing but hold back the entire time. That might be why somebody got restless and moved on. I feel like somebody sat on an offer. This is being guarded. This is also being guarded or keeping your guard up. Nine of Wands, keeping your walls up. Being ready for the attack. All right, hold up, hold up. Why the Four of Wands reversed? reversed. Seven of swords. Withholding. Withholding. Somebody withheld information. Somebody was being sneaky. Somebody wasn't exactly being honest. Like, I'm going to let you have these two swords, but I'm going to keep these five to myself. It's like half-truths, if they were speaking at all. It's withholding. Keeping things behind locked doors. Four of Wands reversed again. Keeping things behind closed doors. Why the Knight of Pentacles reversed? Reversed, Eight of Cups. Something moved on. Death at the bottom of the deck. Old cycles to end so new cycles can begin. Breaking the chains that bind. If you're going to continue to withhold from me, I'm just going to move on. on the towel. I know everything I need to know. High Priestess reversed, High Priestess reversed. She's a little jaded, but not bad. It's not, it's, there's jaded energy coming off of it, just like there's jaded energy coming off of that. I don't know whose jaded energy it is, but somebody threw in the towel on the situation, and it has been thrown in for a while. Why the Ten of Cups? Why the Ten of Cups reversed? Queen of Cups reversed. Queen of Pentacles in the upright. Six of Swords. I'm not going to address this because this looks good too. Somebody didn't concentrate on love for a while, did they? No. No, you don't worry about love. Those days would come. It's not something you worried about. You worried about leveling up. You were here. You were good on your own. You were okay. You were okay. And you're going to be okay. 
Somebody else ain't. But you're going to be okay because you're leveling up. you good. You're not letting this bother you. You're letting, you're letting that wheel spin in your favor. The wheel of destiny. Things are looking up, but you got to stick to your guns. you got to be on guard with whatever this is. Whatever's been throwing shade at you and holding back from you all this time. You need to stay in that stance of move on from it. Because on the other side of that river, there's that beautiful place where this is. Where this is. Those ten pentacles. Those ten pentacles that this person's been withholding from you. Knight of pentacles reversed. Page of pentacles reversed. All right. Let's get a wisdom. Get better off for coming in. Get better off for coming in. Oh, well. Mending and loyal heart. You guys got a bonus today. We'll go with 52 first. Mending. Hmm. Is there something here that can be mended? Forgiveness, making amends, healing after arguments. Oh boy, here we go. Okay. Each time we are hurt and allow the hurt to pass through us without understanding and integration, we accumulate an unwanted burden. This keeps us chained to the very things we need to heal. The pain, the memories, the echoes, the resentments, and the arguments that we rehearse over and over. Now is the time for mending rifts, healing wounds, and letting go of old hurts in order to reclaim your power. Now is the time to forgive, to release, to make peace, and to make amends to others. Set yourself free. Okay, that says to me, whatever the hell this is, <laughs> someday I'll be able to forgive you. Hopefully someday you'll be able to forgive me, but we ain't doing this again. <laughs> Unless you choose to. That's your choice. That's your choice. This little cup could be a cup of apology. Oh, justice is under it. Whoa, whoa. <laughs> But so is the Eight of Pentacles reversed. And there's that Knight of Swords. The Knight of Swords again. Knight of Swords already on here? I feel like the Knight of Swords is already be on here once. Maybe not. Maybe not. Oh! Knight of Swords right there. It's in the upright this time. Not my place to tell you how to live. It's not why I'm here. I'm here to provide guidance. Number 35, Loyal Heart. Number 35. Fidelity, loyalty, devotion. Evidence of loyalty will appear in your life. Others will prove they are faithful to you. And you will in turn commit fully to them. There is a sure and abiding certainty in your heart. Know that spirit is always loyal to you. No matter the outer circumstances in your life, trust and have faith, for you are eternally loved, always divinely protected, and divinely directed. Didn't I say earlier that you're being protected? Didn't I say that earlier? This is protection. This is protection. All right. I'm going to pause, clear, and we're going to move on to air, and we're going to call it a night, so give me a sec. My air sign friends, Gemini, Libra, Aquarius, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, February 26th to the 5th of March. Throw them down for your air signs. Quick shuffle. Quick shuffle. Let's see if I can get one to fly out for us. Oh, 
Why? The sun. Happiest card. Bliss. Could be dealing with Leo. All right. Four shuffles. Okay. Wow. Let's try that again. Four shuffles. You got something you want to tell somebody. You have a burden you need to release. The challenge is you're being silent, Sam, not saying nothing. Okay. All right. Emperor at the bottom of the deck might be an Aries. I also have Capricorn. I have Virgo. I have Libra. I got a little bit of everybody right now. really got his shit together. He really does. The Emperor has found balance and gotten a hold on things. He is all four kings rolled into one. Nope. Four wands. Why the Ten of Wands reversed? Why the Page of Wands reversed? trouble transitioning our way. Fours happen before a transition. Sixes happen after. Two's choices to make. That's beautiful. That's bliss. The sun, the four of wands, that's celebration. Six of Swords, Six of Pentacles reversed. Give me one. Give me one. 
don't celebrate yet. You may have a reason too soon, but don't celebrate yet. There it is, Wheel of Fortune. Is that why you're being silent? You feel like you can't fix this? Are you being silent? Ten of Swords. Mm, shit. Ten of Swords reversed. Sun's not going to shine again. You feel like it's time to move on. You feel like it's time to allow that wheel of destiny to spin, but something you need to get off your chest, but you can't. Why the Two of Cups for what's coming in? Why the Two of Cups? Why the Two of Cups? Oh gosh, it gave me three. Okay. Queen of Cups, Three of Cups. One's reversed. Why the Queen of Cups? Sun reversed. <laughs> Strength. Holding back. Holding back. There's something new coming in. There's something new coming in. It's when you least expect it. It's when you least expect it. Just when you were going to give up. Just when you were going to give up. I feel like... <laughs> party for mom. Some of you could be like a party for mom. Mom's hosting a party. Party for somebody's mom. You're going to meet somebody new at a party. Just when you were ready to give up. Just when you were done. Why the Eight of Wands reversed? Why the Eight of Wands reversed? Why the Eight of Wands reversed? Strength gonna hold back. Mm. Oh gosh. The tower comes flying out in the reverse. What? You been a ghost to Mofo? Really? Why the tower reversed? Why the tower reversed? Ten of Wands upright, Ten of Pentacles reversed. It's not time to build the tower yet. That's why you're holding back. You're gonna ghost. You're gonna ghost. You got something to disconnect from. You got something to disconnect from first. Why this why the devil reversed? Why the devil reversed? The fool. Hangman reversed. Seven of swords. Why the fool? Why the fool? Gonna go back and get your swords. Oh, there's gonna be conflict. Somebody's gonna come back for their swords. There's gonna be conflict. You're finally gonna disconnect from something so you can move on. Something that's got its hooks in you. They don't want you to move on. That's why there's going to be conflict. Nine of Pentacles. They do not want you to declare your independence. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, no. 
Why did it happen? Why the Nine of Wands? Why the Nine of Wands? Eight of Swords. Walls. These both talk about walls. The walls we put ourselves in. We wrap ourselves up in our own thoughts. We wrap walls around ourselves for protection. You walked away to find your balance. I'm not addressing this anymore. You already walked away from this a while ago. Whatever this was, whatever's coming back to haunt you, whatever you need to close out and disconnect from, you walked away from it. Are you ready to walk away for good? I feel like you're about to, but there's going to be a conflict. I feel like you have something new coming in that you really, really want to go for, but you can't. You can't. There's going to be stagnation and silence here. Why are you finish rounding your shit up judgment yeah queen of cups ace of swords four of wands six of cups three of cups reversed the disconnect you wrap things up with an old soulmate all right hold up Let's talk about the outcome. Two swords reversed. Why the two swords reversed? The moon and the two of swords. You're going to make whatever decision you make. with all the clarity that you have. Even with the unanswered questions, even through the what ifs, there's gonna be what ifs. You might feel like you're making the wrong choice. What if I gave him another chance? What if you did? Empress, what if it had potential to grow? What if? Were you happy? Nine of Cups reversed. You gotta do what's right for you. You have to do what's right for you. Justice. Why justice? King of Swords. Death. Death cycles suck. Especially if it's somebody you've been kicking it with for a minute. They suck. Sometimes the level scales, you got to cut things out of your life. You have to make that logical decision. Even if it ruffles a few feathers. Three of swords reversed. Don't wait too long. <sighs> Manipulation, trying to keep you close. Possibly trying to ease your mind about things, possibly using sex to manipulate you. Balance, 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 balance got to find your balance. This is going to sound super strange. Take a step back. Cut your feelings out for a second. Don't think with your heart. Don't think with your heart. They can pull the strings in your heart. Don't think with your heart. Think with your head. Think with your gut. 
don't think with your heart because they know how to get in there. Sometimes you got to tell people something they don't want to hear. Even if it's if you found something new. You have to heal yourself. Or you stay tied to the devil. Ten of Cups. Ten of Cups. The completion of the cycle. Give me a wisdom. I've been boring people long enough. Give me a wisdom. I'm off my game, guys. Whoa! Clean it up. One of my favorite cards. Poised. Another one of my favorite cards. I'm going to take them both. Clean it up. Number 21. Oh my gosh, there it was. Come on. Clean it up. Essential meetings. Getting to the core of a situation. Freedom from a burden. Cleaning house. Sweeping away what is no longer needed. Ever feel so bogged down with emotional gunk? that you can't think straight? Could you be surrounded by physical clutter in your home also? Too much work? Overwhelmed? Time to clean house. Every item out of place natters away at you. Natters away at you. Sorry. <laughs> natters away at you. Every unresolved resentment, every comparison to others that leads to a sense of lack, takes up energetic space. Every unpaid bill just adds up to an unnecessary feeling of being overwhelmed. Now is the time to free yourself by energetically cleaning house. Just do it. Make room for the miracles that are lining up for you. The wheel of destiny is spinning in your favor. Somebody's trying to hold up a tower. That tower got to go. Mm. Number 48. Poised. Poised. Where are you? Where are you? Being ready. Bringing something to light. Being at your best. Confidence. You can be assured that you are ready for anything right now. You know what you need to do. Your skills are sharp. You've come to this place armed with wisdom and knowledge. And you sense a new phase of your life about to begin. People respond to your confidence. And trust you, this is an auspicious time to begin new things. Friends, my lovelies, thank you so much for stopping back by. They know that you are loved. Be blessed. The plan is to, this weekend, finish up what's left of the February reads. Again, I apologize for the delay between getting sick at the beginning of the month and having, you know, to serve out my time doing both bread and butter jobs for a while. And um, this past week, losing our dear friend, the beautiful old man that hung out so many times, just laid right underneath here. Wherever I was reading cards, he was laying at my feet or he was clawing at me or stepping on the cards, getting in the way of the camera. He will be dearly missed and we will catch him. Um catch them in the next journey I guess so peace love and light y'all be blessed and I will catch you whenever next time happens to be take care